it would be very crass and very weird to start a video journal aimed at the public without actually properly introducing myself and giving anyone that might be interested in these videos some sort of insights into my life and into who I am as a person, as a creative and as a being. I let my friends ask me questions about myself. The first question I got was do you still paint? I still paint. Painting is probably something I'm never going to let go of. However, I ha I haven't painted on canvas in damn like two years maybe. Painting for me is one of those things that I will probably always do because it's one of the best ways for me to express myself. Um that doesn't involve using words. How did you become a fashion designer? I think I was, <laughs> I, I won't say I was born a fashion designer because um, firstly, I'm third generation seamstress. My mother also started a bespoke business. I pretty much grew up in a tailoring house where clothes were always being made. And so <laughs> I've been around um, fabric and sewing and the selling of clothes um, for as long as I can remember. What makes you feel like the best version of yourself? A lot of things make me feel like the best version of myself. The first thing that came to mind is my morning routine. I have a very extensive morning routine where I just try to give to myself before I give to the world and so by the time I'm done with that and I'm prepared to partake in physical reality I feel like the best version of myself and I feel like okay you know what my cup is full enough for me to pour into every other thing in my life why don't you make clothes anymore I don't make clothes anymore because I don't want to right now my creative expression right now just doesn't include making clothes how supportive have your parents been about your career choice um my father's been very supportive um i'm sure if my mom was alive she'd be very supportive as well but my father's been very supportive and if not for him i wouldn't have done anything i wouldn't be anywhere <laughs> what do people misunderstand about you um I'm not something to be comprehended. I'm not someone to be comprehended. How would your parents describe what you do? My father would say that he's obviously seen all the other mediums um, or ways in which I express myself creatively. So he would say that I'm an artist. Yeah, that would pretty much be it. My father would say that I'm an artist. Um, my stepmom would say that <laughs> the first one that came to my head was Modella. But she would say that I'm she would say that I'm a fashion designer. That's what she would say. Even though right now I don't make clothes. How do you get out of slums? Hmm. I lay in the slum and cry, sleep, eat <laughs> and then when I felt my feelings I climb my way out through showing up for myself in various ways it could be journaling meditating even if it seems restless yoga listening to music painting um just various ways that make me feel much better about myself in summary i would say that showing up for myself in any way that i can helps me get out of Islam. What is the status quo you reject? Oh, I love this one. I would say <laughs> I've been having conversations about this um, with my friend Dio. I think it would be that you have to play the game. That's, that's something that I've been struggling with because I took um, 
a hiatus from not just social media but life in general in late 2019 and in between that um that time and early this year when i gradually started coming back to social media and like social life i guess like just being more active with physical reality i had a lot of conversations with myself concerning if i needed to completely be accessible online to become a successful person or brand or the modern i would rather not take the modern blueprints that has been set out for success oh we'll just quickly do faqs that i think people would want to know but my name is sessi sanake sessi k for short everyone knows me as sessi k sana is the name that i gave myself it's a swahili name and it means art or work of art i am a student i'm currently getting my first bachelor's degree in fashion marketing i'm studying in paris and I'm 24 years old. Thank you so much to my friends and my family and my close acquaintances for asking me these questions.